It is a Monday. I hope you're having a nice day. We are definitely warming up the next few days. That's the trend, warming trend this week. And if you got outdoor plans this week, high and dry, you're going to be fine painting, laying concrete, cutting trees, whatever you got to do. Uh, we do have temperatures that are warming back into the mid 80s, low 80s today. We'll go 87 degrees in Redding today. 87 in Fresno, San Francisco with a little bit of a sea breeze, 63 in Los Angeles, 71. We are looking at tree pollens, grass pollens and weed pollens, all kind of not peaking, but some are peaking, some are dropping. They're all high. They're all running high. And so allergies right now, as bad as they get. And with this week, with these warming or increasing temperatures, your allergies are going to bug you. Hot tip for me, because my allergies bug me, is use the, uh, take the allergy medication when you go to bed, which is what they recommend, because when you wake up and you, when the pollens are the worst and your histamines are all kind of adjusted with the, with the medication you took. So that helps. So, but tree pollens, weeds, and grasses, all a thing. The national map shows that severe weather kind of moving off out towards uh, Oklahoma, Kansas, Nebraska, Tornado Alley, essentially. They're going to see some strong storms today. And then this system here is just staying offshore. It'll get in here on the weekend. That changes a lot. On the weekend, we're looking for temperatures to cool significantly, not unlike last weekend, but in some ways unlike last weekend, maybe not as cool. We'll see that in the model. Here is, we're going short today too, because there's not a lot um, going on. So I figured we'll just get to the weather. And then when there's stuff going on, we'll go after it. Here is the fog along the coast. There's Point Reyes. There's San Francisco Bay Area, clear skies there. You can see what the fog, what the wind does to the fog, right? See how it's notched here? See how it's kind of torn apart, ripped apart, fractured? Big winds like we've been seeing, and we are still seeing some stronger breezy conditions today. You rip up the fog bank, but it's going to reform quick once the wind dies down because the sea surface temperatures are pretty chilly because of the upwelling. Okay, so here's the uh, snow up in the mountains. And you can see where the Cascades kind of dwindled down. That's Mount Lassen area, a few snow white there. Mount Shasta kind of stands alone in the snow. And then down towards Mammoth, where they get a bunch of snow. With a little lower latitude, higher mountains, bunch of snow, and it sticks. Here is uh, Mount Tamalpais looking towards San Francisco, Sutro. That fog we saw kind of trying to reestablish itself. This is kind of clear. Montero Point is clear right now. Surf along the coast is about where it has been. No big changes surf-wise um, the next few days. We've got this model. I'll put a loop around us. Here is the vorticity, maximum 500 millibar. And you can see the ridge, right? You see us and you don't see much going on. Not much going on. Something gets close, but no. So that's Friday. Friday, warmest day of the week. Hottest day. I think we'll see Bay Area, upper 80s. In Central Valley, you'll see low 90s. Uh, Southern California, you'll notice it as well. But that little, it's a little disturbance down in your area. But I think you guys will still be in the 70s and low 80s. And then this is the weekend. This is more towards Saturday night. Or pardon me, yeah, Saturday night and Sunday morning. So Saturday looks like best day on the weekend, and that looks, whatever that is, for whatever that is, Sunday, Monday, hmm, looks a lot like last week, last weekend, remember? We shall see. And it looks really weird, right? That's a, I, I, I mean, that's, this is, again, this is next Saturday night, Sunday, and then this is... All the way through next week. So next week looks interesting. Hmm. So if you got, if, I mean, it doesn't mean it's going to happen, but that was weird pattern, right? So we'll keep an eye on that. If you're traveling um, next week and you may want to consider that. This is the uh, forecast for today. Um, 86 in up by Sonora, 85 in Fresno, Bakersfield, 85. Um, up uh, looks like Clear Lake is 80 degrees. Um, Ukiah, 90 degrees. The day after tomorrow, the day after today, tomorrow, <laughs> salad works. Uh, this is the forecast size, a little bit warmer. And then they'll continually, so that's, what is that, Tuesday, Wednesday, that's Wednesday. And then Thursday, Friday, continue to stay in the same or a little warmer. And then a significant cool down 
as we get to the weekend, especially on Sunday, Monday, and a little bit into next week. So we'll keep a close eye on it. Allergies the thing right now. Temperatures in the 90s. Birds have not flown, but at least today they are dry, which is nice because yesterday they were kind of wet down there. Uh, and we'll watch them. We'll keep our eye on them. I'll see you back here tomorrow. Have a great day. It is Monday. I'll see you back here on Tuesday, and we'll talk.